the LA Theater Works production of the Great Tennessee Monkey Trial is an absolute treat. Most people have seen or heard of Inherit the Wind, the uh, fictional reenactment of the Scopes Trial. What this performance is, is the actual words of the trial itself. The trial um, was incredibly important back in 1925 in Dayton, Tennessee, when it occurred, but it has lasting effect. It has affected uh, how we teach science to this very day. We're seeing court cases around the country that to some extent are re reenacting or reliving what happened back in, in Dayton, Tennessee in, in uh, 1925. One of the really exciting pieces of having the show this year is that 2009 represents the, two the 200th anniversary of Charles Darwin's birth. He was born February 12, 1809, in fact the same day that Abraham Lincoln was born, same year. And 2009 represents the 150th anniversary of the publication of, of Darwin's great work on the origin of species. So th there will be, uh, in 2009, a huge number of international festivities commemorating this man and his work and the impact that he has had, not only on, on science but on society. Um, the, the idea of, of Butler University, Clues Hall, playing a significant role in that is, is also very exciting. When the LA Theatre Works first produced um, The Great Tennessee Monkey Trial in 1992, it was received uh, with great acclaim. It was uh, reissued and went on tour again in 2005 uh, to commemorate the 80th anniversary of the original trial. We're so fortunate to have uh, this great company produce and show this amazing piece of work in Clues Hall. I hope all of you um, are able to come and listen and appreciate what's, what they've been able to do and gain a real piece of American history that lives to this day.